With the US Open fast approaching, we're scrutinising the form and fitness of the players considered most likely to be competing for the second major of the season. Adam Scott finished tied fourth 12 months ago and might be a little extra motivated to start well in Pennsylvania, having been tipped for big things at the Masters in April, only to produce his worst opening round at Augusta in 12 years. His ability off the tee should be well suited to Oakmont, though. Another source of motivation will be his back-to-back -to -back top 10 finishes at the last two US Opens, when he fell agonisingly short of victory at Chambers Bay and Pinehurst. There'll be much interest surrounding his putting game following the 2016 ban on anchored clubs. Scott's one of the highest profile players to be affected, but has shown significant signs of improvement with the short putter this season. It's still unclear he'll be on his bag as Dave Clark and Steve Williams have been sharing the role, with Williams returning for Augusta, where the pair claimed the 2013 title. With two PGA Tour wins already this year at the Honda Classic and WGC Cadillac Championship, Scott's looking to claim his second major championship title. He's made the cut in each of the last four years, showing that his game is well suited to the challenges posed by the notoriously difficult US Open venues. Currently ranked eighth in the world, the Australian's hoping for an assured performance at Oakmont to set himself back on track to regaining his number one ranking from two years ago.